Massachusetts takes over the top spot. Jeremy Begat heading to the pit area with his number 53. Oh, oh, oh. Jerry Avis, but now is it by Pat Heath. What an impact. Let's hope all of these drivers are okay. Safety team by Barry Pitts Collins. Turn number four, a bit wide, slammed into the outside retaining wall, slowed dramatically. We need a roll back out on the front truck. Bill, that was one heck of an impact. Pat Haney did not see Barry Kate sitting on the outside retaining wall. Full throttle right into the back of the number 23 Pontiac Grand Prix. We see Very that. fortunate that no one was hurt. We see both drivers walking around looking at their cars. That was one of the hardest hits we've had this season here at the Hills Forest Speedway. Not only that, Heaney got into the back of Kate, but then Heaney got hit after that. It's a credit to these car builders, the safety that's put into these cars, that both drivers, no injuries, not a problem. Both, car, both drivers out and rocking around. Of course, the best of safety equipment being used by all the drivers in all the divisions here at the Hell's Corners Speedway. The uh, belts that they use, the helmets that they use, etc. All top of the line equipment and always inspected by Midwest Speedway's personnel on a regular basis to make sure that safety comes first here at Hell's Corners. What a tour of 63 Impala of Pat Haney's. My goodness gracious. got into the back of Heaney once they were sitting dead in the water here on the front straightaway. You can now, feel it. If you look at the hood, uh, no doubt about that. Uh, Shambo's hood definitely crinkled up on the NNS going number three car. 